Good morning to you, Mark Seth of HurricaneTrack.com on the way to Cedar Key to set out another one of my unmanned storm surge cameras. I wanted to update you on my thoughts regarding the latest information on Hermine. The storm continues to get better defined, might make it to hurricane strength before landfall. Hopefully there won't be any rapid intensification. That would be quite unfortunate. The biggest threat here, there's uh, two of them, out of the four main impacts of wind surge, flooding rain, and tornadoes, the storm surge I think has the greatest threat to life and property right now, uh, followed by the very heavy rainfall. So if you are in the hurricane warning area, you really need to be taking this very seriously. Some of the surge estimates for predicted total inundation above ground level five to eight feet. Want to know where to find that information? Go to the public advisory on the National Hurricane Center page when you click on Hermine and read it under the section hazards affecting land. I can't emphasize enough that that is great information. You need to read it and try to understand it. Turn left onto Young Boulevard. Yep, that's the Google lady talking to me. So that's really I can't drive that point home enough. Educate yourself about the hazards that are expected in your area and then act on those. I'm almost to Cedar Key. I'll post the link to the next camera at hurricanetrack.com. For hurricanetrack.com, I'm Mark Suddeth. I'll have more for you later.